All right, he's still here with Willie Adamas. He's got two segments for us. He has given us good time. We're here at the Skybox. Now, Willie, since the All-Star break, 364 average, four doubles. I know it's small sample size, but it's better to get off to a good start than slow. Yes. Last night, three for four. Let's go into those at-bats because I want to know what's going through your mind when you see what you did last night and when you go today to the park to prepare for tonight's game, what you go into. So let's take a look here. Last night, a nice three for four day. CC Sabathi is on the mound. When you do your prep work, what is your scouting report on CC? Uh, he, he likes to pitch in, so I, I want to be ready. I want, I want to uh, get my head out, you know, in front, so I, I don't get jacked. So first pitch, first at bat. You hit pretty, pretty good. Yeah, he got, he, but he got me a little got bit. Got me a little bit. Yeah. Okay, so as you say, he's coming in here. Yeah. Couple left a slider up, mm -hmm. right? Are you always ready for the fastball here? Yes, you got to be ready for the fastball. Last year, my uh, my first month, I was struggling a lot, but we played Houston, and Altuve told me, if you're not ready for the fastball, you, you're not going to be here for long. So you got to be ready for the fastball all the time. I figure Jose Altuve is a pretty good guy to listen to. <laughs> Absolutely. Next at bat, here we go. Cortez Jr. coming in. He shows you a couple off-speed pitches, you know, 81 slider. Fastball a little up, ready yes. again for the fastball, take advantage, another double down left field. So now hustle, well, you got good speed, it's an easy double. Average, yeah, average. No, no, average. Good, good speed, trust me. And you go in my <laughs> shoes, you realize what not good speed is. But still, are you looking for a ball up in the zone? Yes. Strikes, but up, something Strikes, you can yeah. do yeah, yeah. damage with. Yeah. Okay, this was my favorite at bat for you. Right here against Hale, he throws you first pitch slider, second pitch slider. This was pretty nasty. That was, that was one, nasty, two. Yeah. Fourth pitch, so that's four sliders in a row. It's very easy to kind of fall asleep and get used to the slider. He tries to bust you 93 inside. Nice base hit up the middle. So three for four day. Can we go back to the side view? Side view, I think it was his, uh, well, hold on. We're, we're going to talk defense later. Can we go? <laughs> yeah, yeah, keep going, keep going, keep going. Sorry about that, guys. Oh, wow. All right, so you go to the video, right here, okay. When you go to the video room today, you take a look at what you did last night. Yes. Okay, so if you see this, break down for me some of the keys that you say, this is what I'm focusing on, this is what I'd like to accomplish. Well, I like to watch my hands, because like last year when I was doing good, my hands would go first. So if my hands would go first, my body goes slow and slow and calm. Slow the, slow the pitch down, slow yeah. everything down. So if my hands are moving first, I'm, I'm calm, so I'm ready, and I can stay there and watch the pitch and stay through That's the interesting. So your key here is make sure your hands start Arm to moving, load yeah. before, before your lower half, let's yes. say. Awesome. Yes. Okay, keep it, keep it rolling. As you see, yeah, they go back. Big, stop, stop right there. Stop right Let's go back a little. Big leg kick at, at the point of his high, the highest point of his leg kick. Go back, go back. Yeah, yeah go back a couple frames. Right there, yeah, real high, real high. Yeah, back, so back. when you go through the minor leagues, you're getting at bats. Did you always have a big leg kick? No. Or is it something that you felt like you I, I, I used to do the toe tap first. Okay. But now the pitchers, they are doing all kind of stuff in the mound. They go fast, they take the time. They so pitch you, yeah. It was, it was hard for me to get my timing right. So I started doing leg kick this year. And I, it's been, you know, it's been hard for me to get my timing right. And I'm working to a state not too high because that's been a little bit of my struggle. So when you kick that high, but your mentality is, I'm ready for the fastball always. I've always thought that if you're ready for his fastest pitch, then if your foot gets down on time for the fastball, you're ready for everything yes, else. Yes, because you stay back. You stay back. Yeah. Great point, great point. All right, No, not, uh, we're gonna go to defense in two seconds. Let's talk preparation. Now, you did your video work. Yeah. Preparation, some guys are T guys, sometimes are soft, some guys are soft toss guys. I asked you on the break, yeah. are you a T guy? No. No. Why not? Because I like to see the ball moving. You want movement. Yeah, yeah only in golf do we have it here. Right? And, go, and I'm, not too go, I'm not too good <laughs> not at too golf. Good. So soft a front toss, side, side toss. toss? You like side yeah, toss. Side Tell toss. me why. Because, you know, when I'm side... Where is the yeah, well, you come here. You can, we'll switch up. We'll switch so, you know, with the tee, it, it's easy to hit the ball when it's just there. When the pitcher is in the mouth, it's not. It's moving. So when I'm side tossing, I can just go back like this, see the ball, and try to stay like inside a ball. Okay, so hit the ball into the right center. Side. Right yes, center is right your center. focus. Yes. Do you want that soft toss coming out in front? Let it travel. It just whatever it, it is, mix yeah, it, it all up. Because you know that way, I I'm, I'm not just 
seeing the ball this way. More game ready. More ga yes. Pitcher doesn't throw it down the middle yes. every time. We're looking for everything. That's I right. love it. Great offense. Okay, let's go defense. You play a premium position, shortstop. The Rays, they're one of the biggest shifting teams out there. Let's roll the tape. Right here, you're on the right side of second base. Yes. Obviously, a left-handed pull hitter. Go ahead, guys. Boom, nice play. Is it something where you feel like, are you more comfortable on one side or the other? Like, uh, this is this is pretty nasty. I mean, we're going to our left, we're going to our right, we're making good you gotta plays. Be, you got to be ready all the time, because like you say, we shift a lot. It's not like now I'm like getting used to, but like in the beginning, it was a little it was an adjustment yeah. period? Yes. What you, was the toughest transition? Getting on the other side of second base or playing? Playing, playing like in the middle, like like just just this way to the uh, to second base. Just on the right side yes, of second? Yes, because then when you get a ground ball, like a regular ground ball to shortstop, it's like a backhand. It's so nasty that you got to make so much effort to make So effort. coming up to the minor leagues, did you shift a lot or is, was this a major change from what you were used to in the minor leagues? I mean, in AAA, we were shifting a lot. So it was kind of like a, like a preparation for you to, when you come to the big leagues. So now it's more like, you know, like a routine. And position these guys, do you walk, do you look in uh, infield coach? Do you have a card? Nah, the infield card? coach is always moving us. Basically, it's like a control, were, like. Mm. There he goes, two more yeah. steps, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Puts you in the right spot. <laughs> now, I got to ask you, the combined perfect game that you guys almost had. Okay, you had a big shift. Is there ever a time where you say, man, I don't think we should shift this guy? Uh, or has it, has when it been? I, I it, didn't know we were having a, a perfect game. I noticed really? that at the seventh inning. No way. Oh, yes. Wow. That's interesting. So when I, I asked Chirinos, I say, are we having a no hitter? He yeah. said, yeah, a perfect game. I say, what? And then in the, uh, I think, bottom, bottom eight, that we were shifting uh, somebody. I don't remember who was it. And I was like, hey, please don't shift this. Please guy. don't no, shift it wrong. He's going to hit it a, wrong. Just a blooper to right field, and he's going to get a base hit. But you know, those, those uh, thoughts, they're going through your mind sure. sometimes. Well, overall, I think the Rays, with all the shifting they do, you take away a lot more hits than you give away. Yes. They do a great job. Yes. Willie, thank you for the time. Yeah, Willie, thank appreciate you the time, man.